There's not as much hype as there used to be around NFC, but in this video, we're gonna show you if your phone has NFC on it, which most of them do these days, how to turn on NFC, and then I'll talk a little bit about what NFC is used for. So first to find out if your device has NFC on it, it's like a Sony device. They used to have a picture of an N on the back. Most of the devices don't have labels on the actual phone that it's NFC. Um, so you're going to have to check in the settings, but you can assume if you're using Android 10 or higher that you've got NFC on your device. It stands for Near Field Communication. So to, just to confirm, you go to your settings on your phone under Connected Devices on your phone. You'll da go down to Connection Preferences. So when you look on Connection Preferences, you'll see NFC right up top. It's a little chip in the back of the phone, so when you get close to another phone, you can send things over Bluetooth, etc. So you click on that. It looks like it's turned on right now. So if you see this toggled off, this is a Pixel phone, but whether you're on Samsung, or there should be an NFC setting in there, so you can check on that. Um, so you can put a, a pin in there if you want, if you want to make it more secure. So NFC can be used for all sorts of things. Most commonly, I think these days, it's used for payments, like with Apple Pay, Google Wallet, etc. You can tap your phone even at a store these days. Lots of them have NFC readers. You can just tap and pay. You can also use NFC to share files, calendars, other things from that. So on an Android device, they've renamed the NFC sharing from it used to be like Android Beam. Now it's called Quick Share. So to see what you can do there, um, you go back to your settings on your Android phone. We're in Connected Devices. Under Connection Preferences, you click on Quick Share on the bottom. So I'm going to give you a demo and just show you how that works as an example. Where it says Who Can Share With You, this is toggled on right now and it says Contacts. If you click on that, you can see that it's, it can be shared just with your devices. You can share it with other contacts in your list or you can just share it with everybody if you want to use Quick Share that way. So now that you have Quick Share enabled, it shows on mine for my contacts. I'll show you how to use that. Let's say you want to share a photo with somebody nearby. You have to be nearby because it's called Near Field Communications. Um, click the photo that you want to share for an example. So I've got this cool balloon animal here. Um, you click the Share button and then you're going to scroll down and you see an option that says Quick Share. So once you press that, it's going to search for nearby devices using that NFC chip in your phone. Um, so once someone has a nearby device, you can click share and that photo will be shared directly with them. You can also use NFC tags. So all sorts of capabilities can be programmed into the tags, such, such as sharing your contacts, calendar, photos, whatever you want to share, all sorts of options there. So I hope that video was helpful. I showed you just how to to see if you have NFC enabled on your phone, which most do these days, um, how to turn it on on an Android device, and then how to use Quick Share as an example. You can also use tags, all sorts of other cool options. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you again soon.